Hey guys, um, so I haven't posted a video to this channel in about four years, <laughs> but um, I thought I was locked out of it, but I actually realized that I was still logged in. It was just under like a different name or something. Um, but yeah, um, as you can see, I've aged. I'm basically about 80 years old now. Um, and I'm going through a hard time. Um, what inspired me to make a video recently was I watched these videos by this, um, by this YouTuber named, um, I think her name's Marie Amani Amani, and, um, she's, she has schizophrenia. And, um, I'm not sure if I have schizophrenia, but I definitely, um, identify with a lot of the things that she talks about and, um, really made me start to question whether or not I do have it. And, um, I thought maybe I'd just go through a quick run through of, like, all the things that are wrong with my life. Um, I have... So, I think that I do hear voices, like schizophrenics, but with me, um, you know, most schizophrenics hear things like externally, like they'll hear a voice coming from the corner, or they'll hear a voice like in their ear or something, whereas like with me, I kind of, for me it's like all internal, and the voices are all inside my head, but it's, it's sort of like like all these voices like arguing amongst each other in my head and me just trying to go about my day and dealing with these voices um again i i don't i don't know if like i really do have schizophrenia but like i said like just listening to other people's experiences with it um it sounds very similar to everything that i'm going through and, um, I also always think that people are talking to, about me, like, um, I'll constantly think people are laughing at me, and, I mean, I do get laughed at a lot because I'm pretty, um, I'm awkward, I'm like an eccentric, awkward, weird person, and so I do get laughed at, but, um, I know a lot of it is also just in my head, and I have I have kind of disorganized thinking, so I kind of like jump around from subject to subject, and I, I lose my train of thought very easily. Um, so oh, so back to this YouTuber named Marie Amani Amani. So and I'll link you guys to her page if you want to check it out. Um, what she talks about is that she hears voices from aliens and she thinks um she believes aliens are you know contacting her and i identified with that because so every time i have a marijuana edible which i don't have very often but i mean the past three or four times i did have it i thought aliens were trying to talk to me and um it was really weird. Um, I felt like I could hear them saying that they were here, um, that they were uploading information from my head, and um, I even I think I even hallucinated, and I think I I could like see like two tall beings like waiting for me in front of my house, and. Um, so yeah, it was really comforting t listening to her talk about this, which I know that's like sad, like listening to this girl talk about her struggling mental health and it's like comforting to me, but it was, it was um, comforting to hear that someone has similar experiences to me, as me. Um, and, and I'm not, so I don't want this video to turn into like me talking about my 
marijuana drug trips. Um, I, these things happen to me when I'm not high. It's just like super intensified when I'm high. But, um, yeah, so I've, in recent weeks, I've kind of finally just cut ties with marijuana. Like, I, I have, like, no desire to do it. Which is weird because I was doing it for, like, six years. And, which is a long time. And, um, just, like, daily, daily smoking. And, and large amounts of it, you know. And, um finally over it, finally over that part of my life, and, um, what sucks is that when I hang out with friends, well, m friends from high school, they always want to smoke weed with me, because that's how they remember me, right? They're like, oh, it's Angel the pothead from high school, and, you know, they, their first thing to ask me is, hey, want to smoke a joint, you know, or, and yeah, and like, I want to say yes to them so bad. Like, I want, all I want is to be able to be normal and, to, you know, smoke a bowl with my friends. Like, have some fun, have a relaxing time, but I can't do it anymore because it just ends up, it just ends with me being like super um, dissociated from my body and like, it's like I'm watching myself interact with these people and I'm having all these negative thoughts like, oh, she's talking about me, he's laughing at me they hate me, I'm stupid, you know, and, um, yeah, so I get, I'm, I'm over marijuana, um, and also, like, sometimes when I hang out with friends, um, you know, they'll ask me, like, um, well, when I hang out with friends, when I'm in a very bad place mentally, like, when I'm very depressed, or when I'm very, um, in a bad state of mind they're like oh are you smoking too much weed and they all like look at each other like 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 they just think oh he's just smoking too much weed like they think that's my problem and it's like I wish that was my problem because then I could just quit weed and then everything would be fine right but it's not that simple and I wish it was but it, it isn't and um I'm really in a place in my life where I have no friends. Um, I have like, you know, I have people who will hit me up and be like, oh, we need to hang out soon, you know, but I shouldn't say people. I have like one person, um, but, and then I'll get invited to like parties sometimes from my high school friends, but you know, I don't belong at parties. It's not my idea of a good time. I don't, I always fall to the, well, two things happen. I either like fall to the back and just like don't talk or I go completely manic and I'm like super hyper and um, saying all this weird shit, just rambling. And yeah, don't enjoy parties. Um, I just wish I had a friend who would, you know, hit me up and be like, hey, we should go. Like, do you want to go get something to eat? Or do you want to go watch a movie? That's all I want out of life, but I don't have that. And it's weird because I have like hundreds of people across social media who I can like, you know, broadcast my stupid thoughts to or like share my picture of Starbucks with, but I have no one to hang out with. And that's so funny to me, like, and um, well, it's also not so, I sound a lot. Never mind. Um, what was I gonna say? It's also partly because I think I'm a really depressing person to be around too. Like, I mean, I could probably put myself out there more and try and hang out with people more, but I don't because I know that a lot of the time it's not fun hanging out with me. You know, I'm I'm a pretty depressing person. I'm. I always want to talk about my problems <laughs> and um, you know I'll be hanging out with friends and then it'll pop into my head like hey you should mention your your um, schizophrenic disorder <laughs> and, like nobody wants to hear about that no one wants to hear you talk about your mental health struggles you know and but that's all I ever want to talk about like I just want 
I don't know if it's like I want people to feel sorry for me or if it's like I just want people to understand what I'm going through so that they know why I'm so fucking weird, you know? Um, but yeah, I've been trying to stream on Twitch lately. I think it's kind of helping. I've made a couple of friends on Twitch. Um, so if you guys are into gaming, you could totally follow me on Twitch dot tv slash starseed6 um it's my channel again it's kind of depressing just me like complaining about stuff <laughs> complaining about having to do things in the video game um but yeah god damn i feel so ugly <laughs> I was kind of scared to post to this channel just because I, you know, I looked so much better and younger like four years ago. And now I just feel like a, a mess. But hopefully I get good responses. And um, yeah. So if you guys want to talk about your any of your mental health issues, I would totally love to hear about it. Um, yeah, I'm bad at this YouTube thing. Peace, guys.